single-sided liquidity pool. So we have a pool and there's a liquidity pool. So a liquidity pool will be, you know, whatever the tokens will be in there. And what does single-sided mean? Single-sided there means that there, there are two sides to this liquidity pool, but you can only choose to put just one side. Either you can choose to put both sides or you can just choose to put one of either sides. So in this case, let's take a very simple example. And we just, let's say that only in single-sided liquidity pool, it's only filled by one side. So let's say, let's use the Lisa token, for instance. So we add for single-sided liquidity pool, then we add Lisa token into the single side. And who puts in the other side? That's Bangkok, that's the protocol itself. So it will mint BNT tokens, so freshly minted BNT tokens to be added into the liquidity pool. So this BNT token is added by the Bangkok protocol itself. And the Lisa token is added by the users, by these liquidity providers. So the concept, what is the concept that we have over here? The concept that we're talking about over here is co-investment. So a co-investment where one party puts something in and the VC, the investor, the, the advisor, they put an amount in as well. So they're co-investing in this liquidity pool. So they have both ownership towards this liquidity pool. But to keep things simple, let's say all the Lisa tokens are added by me, the liquidity provider, and all the BNT tokens are 100% added by the by Bangkok protocol itself. So in single-sided liquidity pool, then I'm adding the Lisa tokens and Bangkok is adding the BNT tokens.